What's going on, Wild Foods? You caught me while I'm in Florida seeing one of my best friends. This is Jessica. Hey. Say hi to our YouTube. <laughs> I wanted to show you guys what I found in her kitchen. Of course, a bunch of wild products here. And we've even got like some old Cocotropic. I love it. She just made a big order and got our new plant protein, which we've been showing you guys. Cocotropic, when did you order the Cocotropic? Um, last year sometime. Yeah, we've changed our labels. This is our old bag, it's so funny. So, what have you tried here, Jess? You've done, and wait, how long have we known each other? Oh my God. Um, <laughs> guys, my best friends years? from no. Florida. I'm here eight in Tampa, years. Florida. Yeah, we've probably known, maybe even years. Probably eight years, eight guys. To ten. We used to uh, do a lot of fun things together, and we got more stuff lined up. And we had a great time here in Tampa. So you've been ordering uh, wild foods regularly, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> and what are some of your favorite products that you're like, like your go-to's every so day? So my favorites are definitely the MCT oil and the wild butter because- Cocoa butter. Cocoa butter, yeah, it's amazing. And, and uh, I'm gonna show her how to make fat bombs soon. We tried doing that on this trip, but I'm just like running on little time here, so <laughs> we did what we could, but. But I'm really excited about the wild power plant. Yeah. Yeah, power plants. Um, so I'm really excited to try that. And you have to show me some recipes or. Yeah, you know. so the best way to do it is you can, um, or the easiest way is just to add it into like some nut milk. And if you really wanted to, you could put it in water, blend it up. Um, it's so delicious. It's got a really good flavor, and you can make a ton of desserts. And can like, I add this? Sorry, to absolutely. You. Yeah, you can add your MCT oil. Stuff. You can even add cocoa butter if you want, depending on you know how you want it to taste. But the vanilla chai spice is really nice itself. Mm, okay. So, and by the way, if we have any viewers out in Florida in the Tampa area, she is a realtor. How long have you been doing this? 13 years. 13 years, girl. Wow. She's really established here and she's even like a master at flipping homes. So I'll be sure to uh, link. Property management. Yeah, property management. I'll link all her stuff below. We're excited to get her online presence up and going. Mm -hmm. That's gonna be a new I'm thing. Slacking. Yeah, it's gonna be a new thing for her. So Jess, I know that you are extremely busy with work and everything, but you prioritize home cooking mm -hmm. and using real food ingredients and you primarily cook homemade everything, right? Yeah, pretty much. Yeah. Even so, my dog's food. Yeah, guys, she cooks all her own dog's food at home, which is so good because dog food can be really bad. And so my last question to you is, why is it important for you to cook your food at home? Why? Well, first of all, I feel amazing. <laughs> um, it's it. actually a stress reliever for me as well. So when I get some time off and I get to cook, it's just I'm in the zone and yeah. I really enjoy it. Because um, you know you're making something for yourself and it's mm -hmm. nourishing, whereas mm -hmm. you're going out and spending extra money to oh, yeah. to That's consume beautiful. poor quality ingredients exactly. and then feel like shit about it. Mm -hmm. Or then feel like shit and there's Period. no point in that. Right? Guys, check out her backyard. This is like a dream. This is Florida living at its finest. Isn't it, Jess? Yeah, yeah I love it. Oh my gosh, I used to live in Florida. I'm from Florida. We are from Fort Myers. So guys, be sure to like this video for us and for Jess. <laughs> Show her some love. We'll be, we'll be sure to link everything below. Comment if you have anything for Jess. Comment if you guys are from Florida. We'd love to hear you. We'll see you guys soon. Bye. Bye.